In Gmail, you can snooze messages if you can't act on them right away. And this is true on the desktop or in the mobile app. So when you have a message in your inbox you can't respond to right away, you can select the message and click on the snooze option that shows up above or hold your mouse over it and click on the snooze option to the right. And when you click on that, you will see suggested times of when to unsnooze it or when the message should come back to your inbox. You can select one of those suggested times or choose a custom time with pick date and time and set whatever custom time you would like to see and click save. The message will disappear from your inbox and you'll see the same thing is echoed on your mobile device. If you need to find it before it's unsnoozed, you can click on the snoozed option in the menu on the left and you'll see the message there. Once it's unsnoozed, once that time is up, the message will come back to the top of your inbox with a new indication and the indication in orange showing it was snoozed and when. And you'll see again the same thing on your mobile device. When you click to open the message, that's considered kind of acting on it. So if you open it, the snooze indication will go away. So keep in mind, if you open it and you can't respond right away, you can re-snooze it from the menu at the top. So you have the option to be reminded again. Now those default times that you see in the pop-up here, you can set on your mobile device or you can set it in the desktop. Now in the desktop, you're gonna do it in Keep. So go to keep.google.com and then go to the gear and choose settings. The reminder default, the morning, afternoon, and evening times here are those times that are suggested when you go to snooze a message. So if you want a different time for any of these suggested times, make the change here however you want, click save. And then when you go back to your email, you might need to refresh your email account. And when you go to snooze, you'll see any changes you made there, you will see here. On your mobile device, to snooze a message, swipe to the left and then choose from the suggested times there. Again, these are the default settings or choose the custom date and time and choose whatever custom time you would like to see and save it. To find the snooze messages, click main menu in the top left and select the snooze label and you'll see the messages there and when they'll be unsnoozed. When the snooze time is up, you'll see the message comes back to your inbox and even if it was sent originally the longest ago in the past, it'll go to the top of your inbox so it's really highlighted there. In mobile, if you want to change those default snooze times, click the menu option in the top, scroll all the way to the bottom and choose settings and then the account you want to change and then snooze settings. And here you'll see the custom times for morning, afternoon, and evening. The additional option you have in mobile is to set which weekend days you want to be your weekend. So if you want that easy access to snooze something till Friday, change your weekend days here. Any changes you make will show up in both devices. So if you set those here, you will see that across all devices. The other thing you'll see in settings is swipe action. So on mobile, by default, swipe left is snooze, but you can set either swipe left or swipe right to be what you want in here through the swipe actions customizations. So on mobile, if I open a snooze message, when I go back, I'll see the snooze indication goes away. So if you open a message on mobile and you're not able to act on it, you can re-snooze it by clicking on the three dots in the top right and choosing snooze and whatever time you would like from the options there. Snooze is a great tool to help get a little visual reminder and to get things back to the top of your inbox when you know you can deal with them.